the worst games people have considered over the years is Firefighter for the 2600. Now, it was made by a Magic in 1982 or 83, I kind of forgot. Huh. Huh. Okay. According to Death Bear, it's one. It's obviously one of the worst games on the 2600, but was it as bad as he said? As they said? Well, why not play it? And you don't know if it's bad until you play it. Time to play one of the worst games people said. So, there are two goals for this game. Kill the fire or save the person. Yeah, there are two goals. That's pretty unexpected for the Atari. So, to blast up, you point up in the joystick. Right? You have the fire keeps spreading, yet the person only goes to run what row if there's absolutely no fires there. It's actually pretty easy to get the fires out. And there's no dead end for the person. Person, so it can just go, so he can, person could just go all the way up and be completely safe. So why bother going down? Anyway, I'm about to eliminate all the fires here. Yeah. Pretty basic. I actually got out of my fire truck. Now to activate the fire truck, you have to press the button. To activate the fire truck, you have to press the button. And to go up, you have to go point up in the joystick. And to go on it, you have to jump on it and then go up in order to save the person. Then you get the points. Hey, right? there's no points actually. It's a time limit. You're you're judged on your time. It's like 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 cooking. It's like Gordon Ram cooking for Gordon Ramsay. You're judged on your time. Okay, now you get to advance in the next area. I can play again. I got to I got this one done pretty easily. Okay, before I save the person, I just want to tell you about something that's really hard. Okay, getting on the ladder. Sometimes I accidentally point left, but then I jump off. And the screen froze for some reason. Press the button, now we're starting over again. Yay. Pretty basic game, actually. One of the basic concerns is that in order to get... Down, you have to go all the way back down. Like, watch this. You have to go all the way down, down in, in order to select a new one. And you have to go back up to save hey, that guy. And if so, and but what if you're timed? And what if you're trying to do it really quickly? I actually pressed no buttons on this one. I actually let the fire go. I may have blasted my water. Trust me, this was mostly, mostly no effort. And look, it's going off by itself. I'm pretty sure fire does not work like that. So now the person goes all the way down, and I bring down my ladder painfully, try and select my ladder, and it goes so fast that it's hard to figure out which one is. Like, look, I just pat, I just got it. Now it's time to save. Though it's really basic and kind of boring, so I'm gonna stop right now and get my. Honestly, it's not that good of a game. It's kind of boring, actually. It's pretty basic, but I wouldn't say it's bad. I'm just surprised that there are two ways to, to win at this game. Two ways. They even put out the fire. I actually did both at the same time, but I've heard that they're all... You get them get her out two ways on him, whatever the game is. So, not bad of a game. I'm going to put it at the same level of... Play games as Space Jockey, like I reviewed a while ago. Maybe a, a two. Yeah, that's pretty good. Not good, not bad. Basic. But yeah, anyway, time wait, time to cool this baby down and have to cool this baby down. Now stay out.